Hey everyone, haven't been here in four years. This is Kaohsiung, Taiwan. I'm in the southwestern part of Taiwan today. The date is Monday, February 5th, 2024. Time is 12.30 p.m. Temperature is 81 Fahrenheit, 28 Celsius. The last time I came to Kaohsiung, I was actually on a tour group and we did the Love River boat cruise and went to Fo Xuan Guan Buddhist Temple. But I didn't really have too much time to myself except at nighttime when I ventured out of my hotel and just explored a little bit. So this is really my first time exploring Kaohsiung on my own during the day. I'm at the intersection of Zhongshan Road, uh, Zhongshan Second Road, and Wufu Road. And as is common with many English spellings, here they spell Zhongshan Road with a J instead of a Z. And even on the metro, they called it Kaohsiung instead of Kaohsiung. So you have to deal with these minor little spellings and pronunciation differences while you're here in Taiwan and be aware that they do exist. I'm excited to see this when I go to the Love River. They have the gigantic inflatable rubber ducky, or a bunch of them, I think, until February 25th. This is Kaohsiung Central Park. It's not really a large park, but it is a nice neighborhood park. Yes, Shiva, I am aware of it. I read the news. That's gonna be exciting. Tony Moy says there was two huge ducks in Hong Kong last time. Well, now they're here in Kaohsiung. I'd like to bring you over to the metro station, which is right over there. Oh wow, this is fun. Why don't, I don't see a park like this where I'm from in the US. Kids just get a cardboard box, flatten it out, and they use it as a slide. You watch it, that kid's gonna be a master surfer one day.
Who needs snow when you have a uh, grass surface like this? Really nice to see people having fun here. Setting up a picnic. Be Real says that's a great idea. I know it is. After I see it, I'm like, wow, it's actually pretty simple. I see something. I think you saw it too. Active during the day. Yikes. This is the Kaohsiung MRT Central Park Station. When I was here four years ago, there was actually a waterfall that was turned on, but I don't think this time it is. Oh wait, it is turned on. When I came in here, like an hour ago, it wasn't turned on. I see uh, Kaohsiung MRT didn't get around to taking down the uh, <laughs> holiday season advertising. That's what season it is. I never knew. Merry Christmas, everybody. Who cares if it's not December or November? We're in February and it's Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I guess uh, Taiwan is very slow to take down the Christmas decorations. Slower than most other places I've been to. What do you think of this waterfall? Jengen's here, my favorite city explorer. Exploring my favorite city, he thought I was going to take the MRT. Oh, I already made two videos on the way here. 
taking the Taiwan High Speed Rail and also the Kaohsiung MRT from the High Speed Rail Station to Central Park. So Leek Skalitis saying Kaohsiung is only a 30 minute car ride from Tainan where I was living and so I was there often. Oh nice. Yeah, you were mentioning you uh, spent a lot of time in Tainan. Actually it's the oldest city in Taiwan. And right now they have the, um, the Lunar New Year Lantern celebrations there. I think it's the first time they're having it there in like 16 years or something and it's the uh, 400th anniversary of Tainan so it's pretty big. Carsten 2409 Travel says, why is AK not more in NYC? Um, I get this question every time I visit a new place or travel. So <laughs> if you follow my YouTube channel, you know that <laughs> I'm not always in one place all the time. It's a very nice pond. John enjoyed a two-day stay in Kaohsiung before spending a few days at a resort in Kenting. Yeah, I've been to Kenting also on the tour group. I'm very glad to have gone on that tour group. I saw a lot of Taiwan. Oh, there's a fish there. Saw a splash. Hard to make out any fish with this uh, murkiness though. The last time I was here, I couldn't really appreciate Central Park because it was at nighttime and there was like some event going on. Hey, I see a Formosan squirrel in the middle of the bridge. They're a little bit different than the Eastern gray squirrels, which I've seen for most of my life. They were even in London because they got imported there. But these are kind of like more black in color. They're a little bit um, fatter and they can't really jump as far. But here we are, it's a Formosan squirrel. I think they call it the Palas squirrel too. What is this squirrel doing? Looking between the cracks of the bridge for food? Not scared of people at all. Also, I saw some aquatic life down there. Hey, thank you, Brad2024, for the one dollar. I appreciate the support, Brad. You know, I think that's a blue heron over there. I also saw one when I was in Waikiki in Hawaii.
So they exist here in Taiwan also. Don't feed wild animals and feral pigeons. Just like the squirrel here. Whoa! That's a longer hop than I can do from there to there. Amy says that looks like more like a bitterin than a heron. Yeah, I'm not sure of the wildlife here, the names. But even if not, it does look very similar to a heron. David says people from all over Asia came to Taiwan just to see Ed Sheeran. Oh, wow. We have a few banyan trees here. And that's it. We walk the... Uh, entire width of Central Park. I'm sure a lot of my viewers from New York City are going to wonder like, what? That was it? That was the entire size of their Central Park? Because New York Central Park is huge. It spans all the way from 59th Street to 110th Street. This one is, I don't know, maybe <laughs> 10 streets at most. Let's go on Minsheng Second Road towards the Love River and hopefully we could find those rubber duckies floating in the river. Wish I had my superpower to cross the street instantaneously right now. Or maybe I have the superpower to change the pedestrian signal to a walk signal, whatever I want. I take that. I don't think it's that far to Love River. If you notice around us, 
Kaohsiung isn't really as developed as Taipei is. There's not as many tall buildings or dense structures around. This one, you just kind of have to cross with no signal. Portland Street Bar Beer Hall? Beer Hall? Interesting. I wonder what Portland they're referring to. Because there's a few Portlands in the US, unless that's just a name that they chose. Hey, Claire Chen, thank you so much for the 300 NT. I really appreciate it. Thanks, Claire, I appreciate the support. Got a local restaurant here. Not sure what their specialty is. At least along the street, there's a good amount of trees. Canada Bist, I've seen some Starbucks around, including at the high-speed rail station, there was a Starbucks. Looks like a busy street down this way. I'm not sure if I'd like to do a Love River cruise again. Four years ago, I think I um, made a video on the cruise. I got recommended to visit this area called Sejin Island. Supposedly there's a nice little like beach there and it kind of, it's kind of like a seaside town. I think someone here is burning Joss paper. Tony, I think um, I think they might do the dragon boat races. They have to uh, practice it somewhere. Ski D's asking if I feel safe there. Any tips for visiting? Um, both, yes. 
actually during all hours of the day, I actually feel pretty safe in Taiwan. I can't really say that about other places that I've been in. As far as tips for visiting, um, it helps to know a little bit of Chinese, although you can um, get by without it. And as far as things to do, you can check out some travel websites, check out my channel to see where I've been and make an itinerary for yourself. And if you need tips for the metro and public transit, then my channel's the specialty for that. I'll tell you how to ride the metro and everything. Just look at some of my videos. So I see the river about a block away from me. I don't really remember what part of the river my tour group was let off and we took the boat. But I kind of remember a big um, love sign with Kaohsiung there. I don't know if it's still around, but either we'll find that sign or the rubber duckies, I guess. Hi, Ricardo Brabeck with 10 Brazilian Real from Brazil. Nice. Thank you, Ricardo. I appreciate it. Yikes, no pedestrian crossing light. I think I'll cross, why not? Hey, I see signs for the rubber ducky over there, but I don't see the actual rubber duckies yet. Let's avoid this construction equipment. Hey, Todd Ellis, welcome to the membership. Appreciate it. Oh, I remember this uh, statue. Tony's saying maybe the ducks floated away. I don't know. We will see.
I don't really remember what this statue is supposed to represent, but it kind of looks like a water serpent to me. Okay, good. There's a light here. Okay, are we going to get a walk signal? Red light there, red light here. What are we waiting for? Oh, I think I see the rubber ducky. There's a top of the yellow head over there on that side. So we got to make our way over there. I'm going to zoom in for you all. The top of the duck's head is over there. And this is Kaohsiung Love River. Okay, I think the... Um, the ferry terminal where I boarded the boat last time, four years ago, is down there. I see some tour boats there. Maybe I could take a walk over there, cross over the bridge, and we could walk towards the rubber duckies. Sounds like a plan. Oh, thank you, Todd. Devon would totally kayak that. I wouldn't be surprised if they have kayak rentals. Planet X-15, doesn't Singapore have a similar statue somewhere? Um, it could, I've never been there, but there's a viewer who said that it looks like a statue in Singapore. Gabriel M saying the weather is always better than raining, North Taiwan. You know, in Taipei right now, it's cloudy or raining. South Duck in Kaohsiung. No entry. Let's be careful of this ledge. I learned my lesson stepping off ledges or getting close to them.
what is this? Great Harbor Bridge, Kaohsiung Museum. He asked if they have any Vision Pro goggles in Taiwan. Um, it's the, that building there is this one here. So we have to be, oh, yeah, that makes sense, the star, but I just wanted to confirm it. So actually, it doesn't really stop that station that we saw up there. Like there's no uh, official station there. So what I'll do is I'll go up and like cross over and then just go on the other side of the riverbank. Thanks, Jeffrey Camacho, 100 DOP. Appreciate it. Thank you. So the tourist spots. What we just saw was the soaring dragon fish. And where I want to go, where the rubber ducky is, is number three, the Kaohsiung Music Center. Okay, sounds like a plan. Approximately 25 minutes each tour. 250 NT for a ticket. We got a love sign here along with a Year of the Dragon decoration. Good thing these aren't actual firecrackers. You're not gonna be able to light them. Nice flowers. There's actually not too many opportunities for pedestrians to cross here. There's that bridge and then the other bridge behind me. Just be careful of this. I'm actually a little bit surprised there aren't like more concessions and merchants along the Love River. I remember taking one of those boats and going under these bridges. It's a convenient ramp to get up to this bridge.
is Zhongjiang Road. I wonder what this sign reads. There's something about the rubber ducky. And then they have another one over here. Let's turn on our good friend Google Translate. Oh, uh, Central, a uh, City Council MRT station. Well, that doesn't help us. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, what happened here? Got all vertical. Dong Gao Hui Xiong. What's that mean? Is that the name of a place? Wait, what? The duck just moved. I walked all the way on this side for no reason. Well, anyway, it the duck can't possibly come up this way because uh, of the low bridges. Devin says the duck's running away. It is. We got to get this rubber ducky before it swims out of the way and it's no longer in Kaohsiung. Okay, hopefully the duck will still be there by the time I walk down. Johnson D, wow, how has the duck got here? I thought it was in London or New York. And I last heard it was in Toronto. Or maybe uh, they just blow up a new duck wherever they need it to and they don't actually transport the ducks from place to place, I don't know. You're sure there are multiple ducks? Well, I only seen one for, for sure. Another Formosan squirrel.
chestnut fields saying you like this park because it's so empty. I think during like major attractions and major like holidays and weekends, there'll be more people here. I'm pretty sure four years ago when I was here, there were more people around. Yeah, Devin, I'm pretty sure they'll do fireworks here. And uh, someone asked about kayaks before. Look at what's in the river. There's one kayak there, another over there, and another one there closer to the bridge. We're getting closer to the duck. Tony says the duck's getting bigger. It is. Oh, they have some inflatable um, balloons here coming up. I see a scooter and I think that's Hello Kitty. Let's see what's going on here. Whoa, is that a school with all the colorful cartoons painted outside? Or maybe a library? Yamaha scooter, wow. I don't think anyone's gonna be big enough to ride this scooter. I don't even think the scooter makes noise like most of the scooters do. Whenever there's a green light, you hear it.
Yamaha revs your heart. Actually looks like a very nice scooter. Wow. Sleek. So that's an inflatable version of that scooter they're advertising. How many cats can you handle? And the award for grumpiest expression goes to They even lit up too, they have lights on the bottom. Super cool. So now my question is, should I cross over again to see the rubber ducky or should I stay on this side in the hopes that there's another one facing my direction? But I think, oh yeah, there's another one ahead, okay. I thought it was just for the train, but I see a staircase going up to it. You know, I just noticed something. Laurie says, I vote we stay here. I want to stay on this side because at least we get to see the, uh, the music theater.
Looks like a bunch of people are up on this bridge. Maybe they get a better viewpoint of the ducks or duck. I'm saying it's a LRT station. Hey, it looks like it platform. Hey. What's this mean? Can I cross or not? Oh, my answer's there. <laughs> Whoa. All the kayakers came here just to see the duck. Or at least the back of it. There's another one on this side, folks. This one actually faces us. Yeah, we got two ducks here. Davey, you think there's a third one somewhere? Uh, we'll have to find it. We've uh, taken a long walk just to see one duck up close. Florentin Hoffman. I'll take a photo from here too, it looks nice.
Whoa. So from what I remember, I think these ducks are actually one of a kind and they transport them to different cities throughout the world. Um, now that I saw the artist's name there, I do believe it's a Dutch artist. SoCal says we are the same duck in Seoul, South Korea, but not sure it's still there. I do believe they were in New York before too. I don't think I've seen the one um, when it went to New York. So this might be my first time seeing a big yellow duck too. It's a great place to put it too, with the skyline in the back. <laughs> What's this guy doing? What a rather strange pose. <laughs> This is a better pose from here. Straight on, I don't think I'm blocking anyone yet. I think I'm the first one to think of this pose. Rubber ducky, rubber ducky. That duck won't fit in my bathtub. What will happen if I squeeze it? Will it make a noise? <coughs> Confirmed. Makes a noise. Wow, Devin, 18 meters, 60 feet tall, weigh 31,000 pounds, 
14,061 kilograms inflated. Wow, that is heavy. Heavy. Laurie says, what a sound it will make. I don't know. <laughs> I think uh, it would make this sound, right? I think I recreated the sound effects pretty accurately. Thanks, Boom Productions, for a 279 cute ducky. Thanks, Boom Productions. Appreciate the support. Saying hi from Kaohsiung, Taiwan with gigantic rubber duck. Hung Mao says now you have to walk to the other side to see the other duck. Yes, we have to. Oh wow, the sun is actually shining on the duck now. It looks much better. The lighting is so much better now. have to uh, visit the other duck. <laughs> Can't believe there are two ducks here. So you know what happened? The duck didn't actually move, it stayed in one place. It was just that from that angle, I only saw the top of this duck's head. And then when I got to the other side, um, I thought it moved. But it's a good thing that I stayed on this side of the river because now we're gonna cross over and visit the other duck over there. All right, for this live stream only, I want another temporary superpower. Instead of my desire to cross the street instantaneously, I want to be able to cross the river. Snap my fingers and instantly be over there. Where is the staircase? These people kayaking have a great view. Unobstructed view. By the way, everyone, do you know ducks fly? A lot of people don't know ducks fly because you most of the time see them swimming, but they're actually really fast flyers. So don't be surprised if these big tall ducks start flying away too. Those kids are so cute with a little duck hair accessory. Hey Eric, you're missing out on the gigantic ducks. I just got here. We got a Pomeranian. 
Oh, they got the duck accessory too. There's the Kaohsiung Music Center. Interesting architecture they got here. All right, let's see the other duck. I think once I go over to the other side and show the other duck, I'm gonna start winding down my live stream and plan my walk. I still wanna make a walking video around here. Philly Philly and NYC says ever since I've been on the other side of the world I can't keep up with his crazy schedule. Even when I'm not on the other side of the world, people have time keeping up with me, so you're not the only one. It's hard for me to even keep up for my schedule. So at this point, I don't really plan on anything anymore because uh, Whatever is convenient, people are going to watch me. And at least everything's on YouTube to be replayed or whatever. Oh, the light rail. Kaohsiung light rail. There's so many duck accessories. Might be cool to ride that light rail. I don't know if there's uh, anything worth seeing along the light rail route. I know it makes a circle. You see here the uh, the green, that's the light rail route. It makes a circle. <laughs> I think that's the 85 Sky Tower over there, the one with the large point.
There's a lot more people on this side. Oh, we found all the duck accessory sellers. Oh, wow. I'm young, says Kaohsiung LRT. Just completed a circle. Now ride it free until the end of this month. Oh, I could ride it for free. That's awesome. This is cool. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Why Goren? New Year and. <laughs> I think I should get one because this is like a special occasion. Uh, hmm. Which one? Douwushi. All 50. Oh, you scare me. It's 50 for one of these. <laughs> And they got a, another one. Oh, wow. Oh, they stay spring. Wow. Oh. <laughs> okay. Maybe. Thank you. So, Wuxi each is a hundred. That's Bashi, which is eighty. Okay. Okay. Bye. I thought she said it was 50 Wu Shi, but I guess buying two, she gave me a break, so it was only 80. I got 20 and change back. I'll take it. <laughs> Unexpected discount. Let me put my change away so I don't lose it. All right, now I have uh, an accessory here. You're gonna help me put this on because I can't see myself. Let me sit down and do this. It's hard to do it with one hand. Ugh. Okay, better. Okay. I gotta 
Ooh, it's kind of tricky because this spring doesn't turn all the way. But okay. The duck jammed the signal. I mean, there's a lot of people here, so it could be internet congestion. Oh, Jenkins, yes, sent the super chat. Let me go back. Thanks, Hung Mao. I see. For the duck, 150 NT. Thank you, Jengen. Appreciate the support. Now I gotta wear this duck the entire day. All right, here's double rubber duck number two. There's people who have like three or four of them attached to themselves. I'm going to wrap up my live stream from here. I think this will be a perfect place for me to start my walking video. Thank you so much for watching this live stream from Kaohsiung, Taiwan with these amazing rubber ducks just bringing so much joy here. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>